All right. Alana, she she got charged with killing a cop and only got thirty months. So. And that's the fucking system that we're dealing with. What's up, Bobas? <laughs> My man been fucking bench pressing or something, bro. Dang. Figured that with you. Actually, we gotta talk when you're ready. Yeah, what's talking? I got time. All right, come out here. God damn, you been eating motherfuckers in here? <laughs> oh yeah. Ain't no more guards left. Anyone else coming in, Mr. Chad? Yeah, there should be three more people. Mel, Anto, Cheddar. Hmm, little Cheese Whiz. Yeah, little Cheese Whiz coming in. I think he asked to talk to us, Wally. He gave me a... Please save all intimate assaults for the shower block. Yeah. What you guys doing? Do to get some dinner, Mr. Chad? What's that, brother? So, what you guys do to get uh, sent in here? Oh, just a little fucking high She family a quick buck. Oh, did you guys like keep the money? Nah, I got caught. We're going 20 What's up, boys? All right, well, a couple things actually. First things first, though. Bovis needs to clear the air. Yeah, sure thing, brother. A little word in the yard. Some people's thinking that Bovis was trying to betray Chain Gang. You know anything about this? I've actually never even heard about that. What are they betraying what way? Well, Bovis targeted the Vagos to throw them under the bus. Some Fuck people's em. thinking that Bovis was trying to do the same for Chang. I mean, shit, you never done me, daddy. Hmm. Bovice would never. Bovice owes you for getting out the first time. Shit, we could do it a second time too, bro. You just give me the word. Hmm. <laughs> well, there will be time for that. No but Bovice just needs to make sure that there ain't no bullshit backstabbing happening. Because that's the thing Bovice hates. People talking behind your back and talking like you ain't shit in your face. I'm gonna be real, I haven't heard fucking shit about any of this. Hmm. You've spoken with Goma lately. Goma? Um, I saw Goma at the tuna shop maybe uh, like four days ago. Just for like five minutes. You know the story of Goma, right? I don't know the whole the story, to be honest. I heard he did something to you. Gomer is the reason Bovis is here. Oh, he turned you over to somebody and they... Oh, I know. He turned you over to somebody and that person turned you in or something? Right. Do you remember back when you tried to get West? Yeah, Adrian remember West. Remember how that got fucked up? Yeah. Well, the day after, Gomer the brought West to Bovis. But he put Bovis in cuffs. He turned and betrayed Bovice, even though Gomer was one of the benefactors for Bovice World. He helped Angel and West? That's right. He kidnapped her Weist. and helped her escape. What the fuck? Hmm. Goma the betrayer. Now, oh, I didn't know that shit. Come on, the phone like a snake? Yeah, that's right. Now, Back then, Goma wasn't so comfortable working for Bovice. He knew what Bovice wanted. He knew that there's things that had to be done, but he was too much of a bitch to man up and actually do it himself. So he needed assurances that if he were to get caught working for Bovice, it wouldn't be so bad. So Bovice took the Vagos and set them up so that they could get caught for it. Nothing ever happened. Because they didn't get caught in the same night was when Bovice got turned on. But the Vagos, the Yellow Peoples, well, let's face it, they rats anyway. True. They wanted to snitch. 
They like to talk to guards. Oh, they have snitched shit. before. Mm, both of us have heard this. So, Goma, Yellow Peoples, as far as Bova is concerned, they're fucking dead to Bova. I feel the same way that Bogos have been fucking snitches since day one. And anyone who works with them is honestly dumb as fuck. That's what Bovice likes to hear. Bovice thought he could trust Goma, but he's just a little pussy bitch who's afraid to do the real things it takes a man to do. You damn white baby. Leave his shoes on his feet. Good. As long as we're on the same page, because Bovice don't like hearing that people think Bovice is betraying them. When that's not the case, because if people think that they don't really know shit, because the true meaning of Bovis world is that there's no judges, there's no piggies, there's no hole to come into. That's right, we do whatever the fuck we want to do, baby. Exactly. We don't answer to no one. That is Bovis world. Hey, man, Paul. Hey, man. Now, on the next topic. There is an opportunity for some real change coming in the future. Did you hear about this contract with Judge Stanton? No, what, uh, what contract? Hmm. Beautiful thing, actually. See, back when Bovice was on the outside, Bovice was doing a lot of work, a lot of damage to the status quo, to the system. So much so that the judges had to go outside the law to try to get bovis. Judge Stanton put a contract together. Uh. Give us time, sis. Oh yeah, I'm getting out of here. I'm just letting you know. Mm. Three, eight, four, six. Stop Fuck no. Or I'll call you up for All right. So, Judge Stanton, Kiki Chanel, Eugene, and Dmitry Bakov were all hired to kill Bovis. Nice little price. Not worth anything near what the state was paying, but there's a contract in writing. Now some suits came to the yard asking questions, and these suits want Stanton arrested in jail. Stanton is going to be Bovice's next little bitch. Judge Fuck Stanton, Stanton. going to be holding Bovice's pocket so Bovice puts the blade in his fucking neck. That's about right to hear, baby. Fuck that motherfucker. He used to try to steal my car and shit. That dude's a dirtbag. Hmm. Stanton ain't going to make it from his fucking yard. Now, what Bovice needs, though is um, called a safety net. Right, Bovice okay. gave a job to some people's. Should I walk away? Let Bovice finish the conversation. <laughs> Bovice gave a job to some people's. His job may or may not go according to plan. But Bovice needs to know that you and your people will be ready in case they fail. Of course, you know we're the ones that get shit done, boy. That's right. Bovice would go for you first, but wants to see if other people's is actually as good as they say they is. Well, you know how that goes. Mm. Well, Bovice likes to nice let men fail on their own without calling them out on their bullshit. Yeah, he's that action speak one of them words. Exactly. So just know, within the next couple of weeks, keep your eye out for a court case about Judge Stanton. Bovice will be speaking at this court case. Oh, okay. I see where this is going. Exactly. It's going to be a win-win for Bovice. Either Bovice gets to kill the judge, or Bovice goes free. Hey, that sounds good to me. So if it doesn't go south, we can clean up the job for you. Exactly. Well, if it does. Bovice knows he can count on you and your peoples. And we'll 
to find a way to compensate you if the time comes to it. All right, that sounds good to me, boss. Very good. You need anything while you're in here? No, I'm actually free to go, small little bit. Man. I had nothing to say. Very good. Always good seeing you, Chang. All right, my man, we'll be in touch. Let me know. Will do. Sounds like he hired some shit fucking crew that bit off more than they can chew. They're probably gonna fuck up. And then the real dogs gonna have to clean this mess up. Alright, let's get out of here. What was he gonna do? What was he gonna do? He would have shot you! He was well, gonna shoot you! No, he wasn't. No. <laughs> what? Fuck is going on here? No, you're not. I'm giving you extra 18 Jeez, months. Christ. Extra 18 oh, months. Fuck that! What do you mean? I'm leaving! I'm leaving! No, I'm grabbing you. Panto gang. All right. Let's get this shit going, baby. Back in the chance. So Judge Sands sounds like he's fucked. Judge Sands is the one that used to fucking steal our car and shit. He's the one that took our upgrades off. <laughs> Forgot about that. <laughs> 